Okay. All right. You know, see how the bottom is bubbled out right here. All right. Yeah. It's, you know, the bottle is pretty dense. Pretty thick. <laughs> There's a lot of pressure in it, a lot of air. I shook it up right now. You understand this? How much you know? Right. Because remember, yesterday we put sugar in. Right. Well, today I'm gonna show you guys how to bleed it off. So, hang on. Right. First, I'm gonna say you want to shake it up. Make sure you know it's all you know it's all good and dissolved. All the bottoms you know it's all right because this condition is remember it's fermenting, so there's gonna be some little trashy stuff in the bottom. Right. You want to when you close it, right? You want to close it as tight as you possibly can. Sometimes you might even have to use you know one of those grip things or a pair of pliers to get it off. Sometimes, but and then you just crack it open slowly, right? Don't squeeze it. Right. Just crack it open slowly. So you start to get the moisture around it, and then here. Let it bleed off. Now you see how the bubbles are rising right here? All right, just let it bleed off. You can smell it fermenting too. And then just close it back. Get it tight. So now how the bottles, you know. All right? You understand? So all the little stuff's gonna sell to the bottom and more of the sugar's gonna convert. All right? And then a couple more days, we're gonna have apple beer.